And finally in sport, Ali Husseini is a national freestyle wrestling champion, but his dream of winning gold for Australia hangs in the balance. In tonight's special feature, he talks about his journey as a refugee from war-torn Afghanistan. Ali Husseini is grateful for his new life in Australia. He always happy in here. No, no fighting, no shooting, no Taliban. I'm safe here. I'm training, working. His brother was among family members killed during the war in Afghanistan. Taliban killed my cousins. He remembers travelling to the capital, Kabul, for wrestling training. People come out shooting, killing. No good, but um, one day I think I go to Australia. Ali arrived in the country four years ago. Indonesia to Christmas Island. I come by boat. The 24-year-old spent time in refugee camps across the country. Now he's settled in Sydney and inspiring others. It has so much influence here, you know, changing me. Instead of going to sort of other ways, he, you know, he inspired me to come to sport. Ali is undefeated and the national champion in the 57 kilogram weight class, but he's still on a bridging visa. There is no doubting Ali is one of the best wrestlers in the country, but he can't represent Australia until he becomes a citizen. It's unlikely that will happen before next year's Commonwealth Games on the Gold Coast, though he's confident of representing Australia on one of sport's biggest stages. I'm ready for 2024 Olympic game for Australia. Former Olympian Leonard Sazlaski believes Ali has what it takes to perform at the highest level. Time will tell, you know, he's got the talent, you know, he's got the background, but uh, sitting here in Australia doesn't make it easy. A sporting journey that's just getting started. Adrian Archuli, SBS World News.